Wait a minute. Where's Steve? Um, he went to meet his girlfriend's parents. But we play gin on Thursdays. You could play with me. Oh, uh, Klaus, I gotta take this. It's private, so... <laughs> Stevie, gym night. What's the excuses? You like that? Yeah, it sounds like cute shorthand, but it's actually longer. So that's what I've been working on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yes. Yes, I knew she was pregnant. Why do you think you got her back? You are apoplectic. You know what you need? To relax. I'll tell you what, meet me at the tea house we went to that one time. You know the one with those really great mugs that don't have handles? Oh. How are you? How's Jenna? How's Jenna? Are you kidding? Hey, hey. You need to take a nice, calming sip of tea and abide by the rules. She's pregnant! Her parents won't help, and she's all alone. I, I don't know what to do. Well, I think it's pretty obvious what you need to do. You need to kick this bitch to the curb. Pronto. I can't abandon her. I gotta do the right thing. Steve, that's not your responsibility. If it's anybody's, it's Figus's. That's the thing. Figus doesn't care. All he cares is what his football coach says. Well, there you go. Let's go fix this. Get my gin partner back. But, Roger, what are we gonna do? Steve, I think it's pretty obvious that this is one of those things I explain on the way. Uh, Coach? My mom says if you want to stay over again, you, you have to at least roll up your sleeping bag. Get in here. Shh. What's up, Coach? Biggest, remember how I said I didn't want my players having sex if I wasn't getting any? Well, forget that. Get back together with your girlfriend. Okay, Coach. Does that mean you're finally getting some? No, it's more that the school board heard about my policy, and apparently I'm not allowed to have it. Sometimes in life, you gotta make halftime adjustments. So, get back together with your girlfriend, raise your baby together, and, well, see you at practice. And I hope you don't drop that baby as much as you drop the football. <laughs> now get out of here. Your towel's bleeding, coach. Shut up and hit the showers, Figus. Oh, and don't look behind the door on your way out. Okay, coach. You can have your face back if you promise us two things. One, never say anything about this. And two, run 22 flea flicker plays in a row Friday night. Mm -hmm.